Ah, hello everybody, how are you doing? I hope you guys are having an incredible morning. I am missing you all so very much. Uh, I hope the lockdown's going well. I know a few of you have started school recently and I hope you guys are having an absolute blast being back at school. <sighs> Sorry, talking about school makes me tired. Okay, so I've got something very cool here planned for you guys today. We have some serious chemicals over here. So before we start, I think I better do some safety first and just in case things go wrong, all right, okay, so boys and girls, I have three glasses in front of me. Over here, this one represents us as people, okay? This one over here represents sin, okay? That's also a nasty thing. And over here represents Jesus. I'd like to thank teacher Tracy for sending me this and giving me this awesome idea. I really do appreciate it. Okay, so how is it going to work? So in life, our life starts off half full, okay? Many of the times, sin, which is all the horrible things that happen in the world and that we do to disobey God, uh, comes into our life and spreads. Oops, mess a little bit. Okay, and also begins to change us. Okay, which is not a great thing or great feeling. But at the end of the day, it's not the end of the world. Can I tell you what? Because there was a man called Jesus. Okay, now Jesus died on the cross for us okay so when we add a little bit of Jesus into our life okay, boom he is able to clear up all the sin in our life how incredible is that boys and girls but can I tell you something even cooler Jesus is so cool and so incredible that he died for all the sins in the world not just for me you for everybody and he has the power to remove all the sin in the world. Look at that. How cool is that? So by giving Jesus' life, you can see he's now empty. We are now full and all the sin has been taken away because Jesus died on the cross for us. Okay, boys and girls, so before I disappear, I want you guys to leave a comment down below of what you guys would like to see next week. Um, what kind of lesson do you guys want me to do more dangerous experiments with chemicals? Or would you like me to do a worksheet or another different type of lesson? Let me know. And before I disappear, I have a challenge for everybody. Um, I know all of you guys are missing your friends so much. And I would just like to ask you to reach out to your friends. Maybe do a phone call, uh, a virtual play date, if that makes sense. And just see how everybody's doing. But yeah, I hope everybody's doing well. I miss you guys so much and I look forward to seeing you very soon. Uh, take care.